and welcome back to Music Free Gaming here on YouTube. I hope you're having a fabulous day today. It is a fun and beautiful day for everyone in the general vicinity of the Earth. For those who are beyond that, I can't tell. But for now, if you're in the general vicinity of Earth, it's there, there's a potential for good days. <laughs> hey, how's it going there, Kyle? Welcome, welcome. <laughs> Hope you're having a fabulous day. Hey, so I am going to be, uh, I'm in my vanilla world today, um, and I'm not going to be recording for a video, but I do have some uh, busy work to do, and so I thought, hey, let's stream the busy work, because that's fun. So let's go ahead and jump in here to Minecraft, because that's where the fun happens. And get on the right computer. Okay. And I'm here in my Blaze Farm, because the blaze farm is conveniently enough. Oops. Uh, hey, let's, uh, there, there, I can work the camera now. My blaze farm, of course, is right here in a, uh, of nether fortress. And what I'd like to do today is start paving the fortress, right? Um, cause what I want to do is I want to build a nether skeleton farm pretty much on one, two, three, those three crossroads. Um, and that's going to be fun and cool and whatever. But man, is it going to be a pain to pave all this stuff? Fortunately, I have with me a metric ton of iron. So... So I'll just hang on to that, and, oh, what I need to do, iron, and pressure plates. I know, iron pressure plates are maybe not the most uh, efficient way of doing this, but that's okay. Totally fine. So, let's make our way up here, and, hang on a sec, I need to drop this down. Okay. Woo! Let's do the thing! And preferably do it while continuing to live, because being dead is not high on my list of things to do today. Ow! Okay, no, seriously. Um, so drowns give, uh, copper. Th this world I'm on 119.1 or 2, something like that. Oh, hey, I forgot. Totally forgot. I should do a couple things here. First of all, torches. Let's see now. There is, very conveniently, some dark spots right up here somewhere. Yeah, there we go. Just keep the skeletons and stuff at bay a little bit. All right. Turn off the structure for a minute. But what I need is not ghasts. That That is absolutely what I do not need. Anyway, what I do need are a couple of those. Because I don't want to deal with all of the pain and suffering of... Oh, cheese monkeys. Come on, come on, come on, come on. Got him! <laughs> or something. All right, cool. Yeah, in fact, I have a copper farm in this world too. So, you know, that's fun. Yeah, it's uh, really fun. The uh, the copper farms now. They are stupid easy to build, and it's really cool. First, I really need to pave out. Yeah, guess that's okay. Yep. Yeah. Might want to get gold for piglin trading. <laughs> yes. Um. Since you're a little new to this particular series, uh, the Going Solo series. Uh, 
I have a gold farm and I have a 192 piglin bartering farm. So that is, <laughs> I've got that settled. Now I'm gonna pave this um, for now, just to keep things tidy. Uh, but this is where I am going to be putting all of the farm itself is gonna be here. But I just don't want to have wither skeletons spawning at my back while I'm paving out the rest of this nonsense. Yep. Yeah, because I'm in the nether. Yeah. Yep. Nope. I've got all that stuff. Um, got a gold farm up on the roof. Oh, yeah. This is... Um, please, sir. Can I have some more? Oh, please. I want to make the... Alright. That's alright. I got it. I got it. There's enough pressure plates for everybody. <sighs> now, again, there are more um, efficient ways of using materials. I am not lacking in iron in this world. Oh, you're in the hospital because you got a flu. Yeah. Well, in the last live stream, first off, I hope you're feeling better because the flu sucks. My son's actually going through some form of feverish illness, which not cool. But the last stream I was in in the uh, create world, which was, uh, which is, is still early game. So I haven't had a chance to build all of the other farms and fun stuff. All right. Let's finish paving this before wither skeletons come and eat my brains. Because I'm not a huge fan of having my brain eaten. You know, it's sort of uncomfortable. So, you know, I'm going to try to avoid that just as a on general principles, and I would recommend that everyone out there avoid having their brain eaten, especially while they're still alive, because that's just, that gets really awkward, and it's not unlike being in high school. So, just try to avoid that. Okay. Skeletons eat brains. Eh, everything eats brains, you know. I mean, I suppose the, the blazes just want to uh, roast your insides because it's fun, but all right, so I can take this down. All right, there we go. Well, yes, zombies eat brains too. You know, it, it goes, yeah, just about everything kind of enjoys the... Uh, brain eating goodness. I maybe I'm wrong. Maybe brains are a wonderful thing, but I don't tend to want them to eat my brains. So no matter what other brains they are out there enjoying. Oh yeah, I forgot. I have swift sneak. <laughs> it's like why am I sneaking so fast? Well, it's cuz I have swift sneak in this world. This is what happens. You play a couple of different worlds and you kind of forget what what's going on in one and Versus the other one. All right. Yeah, so the fun... Now, I don't have... I should actually figure out where I'm going to... Build the drop pillar and all that fun stuff, but... And how I'm going to build that drop pillar. So... The way, if, I don't know if you've built a uh, wither skeleton farm, but the way these things work is you, you can sucker, oh, I need a boat. Oh, I'd be, that, um, do I have wood? I don't think I do. Oh, I might, uh, I left my dender, ah, darn it. For some reason, I thought it would be good to leave my nether, or my ender chest back in the, Plays farm. That guy's probably going to be gone by now. It's the entrance to the farms over here, but 
I need a better entrance. This is sort of a mess. Do I have a boat? I don't. Ah, bummer. So... <laughs> I'm the first live streamer that you didn't spam E. Okay. Well, that's good. Spamming is not pleasant for anybody, so... Happy to not have that. Oh, the swift sneak is really throwing me off, man. Anyway, so the way these things work is you can use a... Uh, you can use a piglin. Wither skeletons are not happy with piglins. Oh, except that one, that guy had a crossbow. That's not going to work. Anyway, yeah, so they're not happy with the piglins, and they like to kill them. So you can bait the the uh, wither skeletons with uh, zombie pig or with regular piglins, but you need one that doesn't have a crossbow because you don't want them shooting the skeletons. And then the idea is you drop the wither skeletons into a. Uh, down a, a pit, and then either you or wolves or however you want to do it can then take the one hit and kill off the skeleton. I think what I'm going to do is I'm going to build this one uh, so it's a manual kill farm. I've built the AFK ones where you, where you use wolves, and that's fine. Um, it works, but Honestly, I don't I don't want to deal with it and I kind of okay just getting the looting enchantment here, you know. Okay, so now where things are going to get a little fun. Uh one, I need to get up there and shut that thing off. But if you look at the structure here, just turn mini hud back on. Uh pretty much anywhere down to yeah, right at this level here is viable space for a skeleton. So I'm going to have to clear out all of this nether rack, um, all that fun stuff. And that's, it's going to be tedious. There's no getting around it. It's just going to be a, a little bit of a pain. But they, I guess the skeletons despawned. I didn't think I was too far away from them, but that's okay. Now, yeah, flying up there is going to be a real treat. <clears throat> All right. Yeah, that's going to be a pain in the neck. Cool. Well, you know. Now, the one thing I don't have, which would be nice, is Wither Roses. Because Wither Roses make this... Uh, uh, help make the farm even more efficient because it keeps basically non-wither skeletons from spawning. And that's going to be... I mean, it's going to be good to have. Uh, but... Uh, I have to go off to get the skulls first and then plant the wither roses later. Now, the nice thing, so the buttons are usually the preferred way of doing this. They're cheaper and, and stuff. And they're not so clicky. <laughs> but, I don't know why no one goes to my streams. Well, you know, discoverability is a fun thing. Plus, have you seen the YouTube category on, or the Minecraft category on YouTube? It's like four pages of spam before you get to... Uh, any uh, actual streams, which is a little bit annoying, but that's all right. All right, well, uh, if you stream it, they will come, right? Is that how that works? All right, so we're going to do this, and okay, that's going to stay there until I'm ready to stick it out. If you've never seen a scumpus before, this was uh, 
invented, I guess you could say, by Skizzle Man, uh, who's a fun YouTuber and streamer. Uh, and the idea is you place a block down with a torch on top and then a torch pointing the way back where you came from. So it's easy to figure out where the heck did I come from and how do I get back there? All right. Okay, so this should be... Right, now there is a... You can hear it. There's a blaze spawner around here. Ah, right there. Okay. Now, I have a blaze farm, so I'm just going to... Whoa! Okay, let's, let's actually... Fire resist potion first. Okay. Okay, you guys are annoying, and, uh... Okay. Just kill the spawner. Like I said, I already have a blaze farm, so I don't need this. Okay. Could you please be dead now? Thanks. That was awesome. Wait! Oh, jeez! Monkeys! Well... That's not what I needed. Okay, so... <sighs> minus one, minus 343. Okay. Jeez, monkeys. All right. All right, all right, all right. Um, jokes, impossible to get the answer. Well, yeah. Is it a, say it's actually a joke if there's no good answer. All right. So, let's see. Um, I really need to get some more tools, but. All right, so grab that, grab that. Um, food. All right, that'll work. That'll work. It's a hard joke, huh? Okay. Man, I thought I was doing okay, but apparently I was stupid. It happens. At least I don't have to worry about Blaze picking up my armor. <sighs> or my elytra. Alright. Well, let's get back. Darn it. <sighs> this was supposed to be easy. <laughs> apparently not. All right, let's get back there. Okie dokie artichoke. The streamer was dumb. I suppose if I'm holding a golden carrot, maybe it'll keep the big ones away. Come on, I can jump through there. It's not hard. It's okay. Ah. <sighs> Man, I was just not at all paying attention to my health. I figured I have fire protection. That'll save me. Doesn't stop the... That was just the wind. Okay. Ah, <sighs> No, but it doesn't... Doesn't stop a bunch of things. So, all right. So, I think down this way. I think this is where my... Yep, there's all my gear. Oh, let's see how much of it I lost. Whew, I'm hoping most of it. Okay. My pants. Okay. Still got my elytra, so that's... That's great. Um, and there's my golden helmet. Cool. All right, well, let me guess... Uh, Go and just pave this while I'm up here. And since I forgot to go bring my... Uh... Oops, that's not where that goes. Forgot to bring my uh... ender chest with me. Guess I better go, get... go back and get that. And... <sighs> so that I can at least... At the very least, I need to put my wings away. 
Okay. Go back to my silk touch pickaxe. All right. All right. All right. All right. I got this. I got this. I've got all this. This is fine. All right. See all of the not dying I'm doing right now. <sighs> Lots of clicking, but no dying. I think. Yeah. Take this out too for a moment. All right. This is all going to get fun once I start. Uh, other stuff oh yeah yep hey sprite this is going solo yeah i that's true it doesn't clarify i should well uh -oh. i usually mention if it's create mod in the description whoa ow okay stop okay i do have my shield cool all right so now let's uh get all of this stuff sorted out don't need the mushrooms. Put that elytra back. The, those can go back there. <laughs> oh, what a mess. Okay, important safety tip. Don't die. It, it's bad for your health. Ah, uh, so how you doing, Sprite? Having a good day, I hope. Avoiding all of the... Uh, Random drama. Okay, so don't need that. All right, let's grab. Oh, I, that's true. I've gotten lazy maybe when, since I've switched to YouTube. I, sh I should maybe update my title. <laughs> All right. So, I didn't, oh, I had to fly around it, that's why. It's like, okay, why are they all getting cranky? All right, cool, where's my sword? I did not pick up my sword. Awesome, whoa, hi. Which means it might despawn. Let's uh, hurry up there and see if I can find my sword. It is very possible. I just missed it, but. Um. Okay. Well, it might have despawned. Um. And I don't see it down there. Okay, at least it's not going to end up in lava, but. And I don't see any, uh, I don't see any piglins with it. So, yeah, lost my sword. Well, cheese monkeys. That's not great. Um, oh, hi. Um, I don't know where he went, but. The, the, the sword is broken, yeah. Alright, where'd he go? Alright, this room is safe. Where did that guy go? Oh, he's down there. Cool. I'm not particularly worried about it, but it had looting on it. So, it would have been nice to, uh... To be able to use to... Place the things. Hi. Hi. Yeah, so it would have been nice to have looting to get Wither Skulls, but... Oh, okay. Cool, gotcha. Hi. Gotcha, too. Okay. So, yeah, I'm just going to pave this. Now, the other thing I should do, and I haven't yet, is... Uh, Figure out what the spawning sphere is for wherever it is I'm going to be placing this uh, 
the the farm here. Yeah, this is one of those things. I mentioned it in the Kofi blog is that I'm having a little bit of a creative block here in this world. But I, as I was thinking about some things, I got thinking that Okay, looks like that's... I don't have to cave back here too much. Um, anyway, I was having a little bit of a creative block, but I got thinking that whatever I do, I think some having some beacons is going to be a good thing. So... Oh, hello, Ghast. Alright. No! I don't believe I asked for this gas to show up. I gotta turn this off, I can't see. Okay. Little irritated. Um oh stri yeah. Yeah, that Yeah, strikes like that suck, man. They're just a all they do is hurt the kids. And that's the whole point, right? is they want to hurt the kids because by hurting the kids it means they're more likely to get what they want so yeah i have very uh very low opinions of well government strikes in general but okay. all right now it is also possible there are parts of this fortress i haven't been at so of course that's the whole point of any strike is to cause problems for the management and you know keep them from actually doing business and yeah snowballs do a lot of damage to blazes oh yeah but it's just not worth dealing with it. not worth carrying uh snowballs with you anyway Now, yeah, now, so the whole reason I need to find the spawning sphere is uh, so that I can pave the, the nether and keep anything from spawning anywhere else in the, in the region. Because uh, the, the fewer spawns there are, the more likely... Uh, Wither skeletons are going to spawn. So, yeah, it's it'll be... Uh, it'll be a lot of work. I did this over on Mandolin's server. Um, do I have... I do have some netherrack. Okay. Let's... Let's hop up here for a minute. Wow. That uh, didn't go anywhere. Yeah, negotiating between the government and the union. Yeah. Yeah, the... And that tends to be the way of, of things. So it's like, all right. Um, somebody will give, but... But it's one of the reasons I don't like government unions is they tend to fund the people there... Um, arguing with so so if hey they're uh, those politicians are actually I would say fighting back but resisting with the the union that's in and of itself isn't a bad thing but I don't want to get into politics and stuff that's just I can go on forever uh, but it's definitely annoying <sighs> As a, as a parent, it's like, man, I just want my kids to, you know, be educated and stuff, right? All right. So I think let's just hop back. Okay. What's? Oh, okay. That guy had an enchanted golden sword. But I thought he had a diamond sword, and that would have been really annoying. Because then it's like, um, 
That's my sword. I want it back. I gotta be careful digging this out. I'm gonna fall to my death if I'm... And I don't need to go up the death counter one more time. <sighs> well, I hope they can get things sorted out for your sake there, Sprite. Whew, man. Yeah, I was toying with the idea of doing a create mod today, too. But... What I've got going on there is pretty much just a lot of placing wood, and I didn't feel like doing that today. So instead, I'm going to play, create pressure plates, or place uh, pressure plates, you know, because apparently all I'm going to be doing today is just placing blocks. Doesn't matter which world I'm in. Okay, yep, see, that's, that's a problem over there. See, and part of the reason I need to pave things, if you look at structure here yeah see they're spawning right on top they can spawn in this red walkway here so I need to go take out all of that nether rack and all that other good stuff all right hi tell you what get you out of there see I am a helpful player. I will help you fall off cliffs and uh, all that good stuff. Thank you. Okay. I was going to go somewhere and my mind just shut down, so. It happens. All right. Now. Cool. So this is all blocked off. Um. Yeah, I should. That's why I should pull the structure out again, just to be sure I know where this is going to be. Yeah, yeah. See? I try not to help people, but skeletons? Zombie piglins? Yeah, yeah. I'm all for that. Okay, so yeah, it looks like... Yeah. All the things here. And I had to choose pressure plates. They are super clicky. And it's my own fault. I, I chose to use pressure plates. But still. They're super clicky. Alright. Um, I should maybe not dig out more. Because <laughs> uh, every place I dig out, I'm just going to have to pave. So... Well, I do need to dig this out. Anything above this walkway needs to go. Okay, that way... Yeah, that way I can... Try to keep things in place. Because what I want to do is... By paving all of this, and then... Um, probably paving out... The area around this... So I can focus all of the spawns in my little death area. Jumped off about three cliffs in your life? Now you're a braver man than I am. Okay, how far down does that go? Far enough. Alright, um... Cool. This is going to be fun. Take all that out. I have to take this down to at least here. Now, where are my rockets? Okay. Just uh, let's flop those over there. Okay. Now. <sighs> okay. I have... Fire resist potions. I should maybe think about keeping those on my hotbar. What do you think? All right. Another rack away. All right. Let's see if I can get out of this. Structure off. Okay. 
Ooh. Yeah. So that's an area down there too that I'm gonna have to deal with. Um, yeah. Oh, jeez. Yeah. Any place, any of those things are spawning, right? Uh, especially inside the. I hear you. I hear you, skeleton. And the gas. Wonderful. Oh, yeah. This is just fabulous. Okay. All right. There. That'll at least keep the skeletons off me from that side. Cool. Uh. All right. It's okay. We got this. We got this. All of the fun is going to happen. It's going to be going to... Okay. All right. All of our paving stuff. Yeah, and as soon as I figure out where the... Uh... Oh, hi. No, I have a bow. Seems like... I was going to say, it seems like a safer choice here, but... All right, but... There. We're good. Say we're good. We're still alive. Would you like to solve your riddle? Not really. I'm not into riddles. I don't really like them. For the most part, they are too many riddles are just there to uh, make somebody feel bad. Mock them for not being able to figure it out. And that so it's just not something I'm into. Cool, so we'll get this all paved, and then I need to go up and clear out all of the netherrack above this. Oh, and... Ah, oh, clicky, clicky. I am rethinking my life choices, by the way. <laughs> Do I really, really want to... Uh... Yeah, see, all of this is going to have to come out. Um... So if I've got these three, that means my spawning, the spawning sphere, let's see if I'm dropped down, what level is this? That is 54. I have to drop down 24, I, 24, 22 for wither skeletons. Which means pretty much right at lava level down here. Cool. All right. So that's going to put it right about, oh, wow. All right. So coming right here, this roughly the center of those and right about here. All right. All right. So let's grab a shape. Let's add a despawn sphere right there. Figure, um, here. Okay. Good. And back to shapes. Turn that on. Okay. So everything the life light touches. Do I like playing Minecraft? Yeah, it's actually my favorite game. <laughs> it's I like Minecraft. Yeah, so pretty much everything within this pink. Oh, man, man, man. Back to a server called, like her called Zip Crowd to make another perimeter. Oh yes, <laughs> that would do it. Okay, that is gonna be messy. Cool. Yeah. All right. All right. So everything above this has to go. I'm going to drop a wither skeleton on my head. And, you know, as much fun as that sounds. There's the ghast. Oh, my aim. 
Okay. My aim is terrible. Yeah, I've, I've seen some of those types of, of videos. Like, we're just going to blow up everything. You know, which uh, I could kind of understand the desire for a uh, for TNT duping at that point. I am fundamentally opposed to TNT dupers, but I understand why you would want one. Okay, so take this out now. I just broke that here. Go back there. Um, let's see. Let's see, let's see. All right, how do I want to get out of this? Do I just want to carve it out? Okay, so that's all going away. And that's all. I was hoping that was all going to go away. It's not. I cannot reach it, Captain. It's out of the reach. Okay. Yeah, just a big group. Yeah, I get it. I get it. It's like Exuma. Yep. I can see Exuma being into something like that. Oh, he's been fun to watch in his Create series. I'm getting all sorts of ideas from <laughs> from uh, that whole series. I was watching... We were talking to the Discord sprite about the his iron farm, right? An iron generator. And, uh, you know, he sort of improved it, mostly just setting up sorting and processing stuff so you get bulk items, but, but yeah, got me looking into, uh, some of this stuff. Like, okay, if I were to build this, you know, because I've, I've got, one of the things I want to, I'm going to need a lot of, just in general, because Create uses it a lot, is Andesite. And I have no clue how I want to handle all of that Andesite. I mean, I could, I can go mine it, right? And there's some good auto diggers and things like that. But there are also, um, it's also possible to farm andesite through, uh, it's a weird combination. It's like you have to mine gravel and then, or mine, dig stone and turn it into gravel. And then you can do some other stuff with it. I don't remember what all it was, but it was, uh, actually, oh, hey, there's a gas tier up there. I suppose I should get that. Also, I don't need these mushrooms. Why am I carrying these mushrooms? To be honest, I don't even, don't even need the uh, quartz, but... Yeah, I, I didn't watch... Yeah, I didn't watch that one. Um, I did watch the, the mining one, though. Yeah, because I've already got an iron farm in, in the... my create world, so... Building the machine to to get it just kind of seems. I, I just don't need it, <laughs> honestly. Is is really just what it comes down to. Okay, so right, there's the magma. Oh, hi, Wither Skeleton. Um, I have removed all of my protections. Wonderful. All right. Oh. I didn't think I was going to one-shot him, but okay. Cool. <laughs> it looks cool, though. The um, That whole process of, well, let's see. We're going to grind up all of this stuff, and then... Okay. There's the Wither Skeleton. I don't know if he can reach me, though. I think he might be able to. Let's see, is there a... Oh, no, he can't. Cool.
Gotcha. I am kind of wishing I had my looting sword, though. Ow. No, don't. No, no, no. No, no, no. If I'm going to die again, it's not going to be to a stupid magma cube. Especially a little one. Ew. No. I'm over here. I know, I'm getting a little... Oh, I already paved this one. It's like, oh, since I'm over here, I should pave this real quick, because I know it was sticking out, but... Oh, this thing is huge. This is a... This is a large fortress. That is a ghast. I don't know where he went. It's... <laughs> Okay. He's outside of all of the spawniness. All right, cool. Cool. All right, so the good news is this whole area is going to be outside this. I'm going to pave the fortress here, but uh, I really am not going to need to worry about it. And the guy shows out to filter flint into... Oh, yeah. Flint into the collection chest. And... Yep. Actually, I set that up. Um, I was... I did it all after the stream yesterday. Because I, I ran out of time. I wasn't quite done with my... Getting the iron farm stuff sorted out. Uh, but... After the stream, I, I set up the, uh, what are they, the brass, uh, a brass tunnel with a filter on it so that all of the, all the poppies went into a composter and all the iron uh, went into a press to get turned into blocks. So, so that was nice. And now it's all being pumped up into what will be my new iron storage room and probably trading hall for all of the various uh, tool smiths and other smiths and armorers and all that good stuff. The people who I'm going to be trading it with for emeralds. So how far out does this go? Oh, it, it pretty much doesn't. It just hugs the... It hugs the walkway. Cool. Well, that's good. That'll make this a little bit easier. Oops, stop. Structure off. Oh, the problem I have right now in create is that I don't have um, I don't have enough brass and so I have to which you get with farming copper and zinc and the copper long term isn't going to be that big of an issue because I can set up a copper farm zinc on the other hand is going to be a problem so I need to take a look and just see if there's if there's something I can grind and get renewable zinc, otherwise it's going to be mining machines all over the place. And, you know, as fun as that sounds. There's actually a spot fairly near my, my base that has four um, slime chunks just all right next to each other sort of uh, in a line and I don't particularly need the slime chunks since I have a slime generator now not a pretty efficient one but I have one <laughs> mm -hmm. uh, uh, but I suppose it'll be fun to dig out all of that uh, with a digging machine I think that's I'm gonna do that this weekend and that'll that video will go up. 
don't know if it'll go go up next week or the week after. It's Thanksgiving here in the U.S. next week, so so I'm not sure how I want to handle that. I didn't bring. Okay, no, that's fine. I didn't bring my my nether chest, my ender chest, uh, but I do still have my iron chest. So, and honestly, I don't need bones. Um, I'll put the nether quartz just because it could be a fun block to build with. Stone. Cool. <sighs> but I am really digging the auto crafting capabilities that are being created. That's been. Oh, jeez. No, 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 no. Uh-uh. Okay, I'm gonna die. <laughs> Let's, uh... Follow the stupid ways to go. <laughs> Flying away from a piglin because I broke my... my uh, I picked up my shulker box. It's definitely not one of the most glamorous. Alright, so... Let's see. Gotta take out... Let's combine those. Those... Grab a fire resist potion just for, just in case. All right, now how high does this go? Oh, pretty much just to there. So they actually could spawn on top of my little uh, protection over there. Clean all of this sent out, or at least up to a point here. A point I think is going to be right about there, to be honest. Because I think what I need to do is just go pave up top. Okay. Where'd you go? Where'd you go? Where'd you go? gonna be one of those gas he's gonna shoot and despawn and I was like hi I I'm gonna sit and whine and then I'm gonna shoot at you and then I'm gonna run away seems like a real gas thing to me. all right oh so clicky yep I get why uh pixel riffs was wanting to uh not use uh, pressure plates and use uh, buttons instead, but you know, <laughs> I have ridiculous amounts of iron and I don't have ridiculous amounts of wood. So my create world, oh yeah, that's that's a whole different story. But uh, okay, yeah, so think yeah it just it just hugs the that so cool yeah I don't have to worry about I only have to worry about paving this because it's inside the spawning sphere but even that as long as I'm 24 blocks away which I will be um most of the other mobs are going to despawn. So, and they don't spawn inside the chunks here. I could have used stone buttons. That's true. That is true. Okay. So I think this is probably going to be okay. All right, so... But yeah, I absolutely could have used stone buttons. That would have that would have been probably a good thing. I want to get up here though. I think this is all right. I know. Sorry, I keep turning the structures on and off here. 
Okay, and that's outside the fortress. All right. Cool, cool, cool. All right. Nice. So. Oh, the next thing I need to do, this is actually the hard part, kind of, is I'm going to be spawning, uh, well, I'm going to clean off the pressure plates and level this out, but I need to set up the drop station, and I think it's going to be, so it's going to be right here in the middle. Which means I'm going to have to dig down through one of these. All right. What would be awesome would be some ladders, which I do not have. <laughs> and probably... Actually, yeah, I need some ladders. So probably the way I want to do this... Um, yeah, I'll dig down through this... I guess once I get down there, it should be fine. What level is this? That block is 32. Okay, so if I get down to block 33, it should be fine. So, all right, well, this seems reasonable. Whoa, 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 whoa. Okay. Drink that. Okay, that was, that was great. That was awesome. <sighs> yes, the lo lack of planning skills. That was, oh, that was smooth. All right, cool. Where's, uh, where's one of those pillars? That would be right here, right? <laughs> oh, I'm glad I had the noob juice. That was, uh, a little hot. <laughs> I want the ender pearls. I don't want the problem. Okay. 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 We're good. See, everything is, is fine. All right. So now this one straight down. All right. So now I'm at 33. All right, so cool. I want to come down basically to lava level. I think is how this is going to work. All right, now. Whew, Swift Sneak is really throwing me off, man. <laughs> I know, right? Dig straight down. All right, I'm just going to take this all the way across. And... And then let's add the pressure plates to uh Alright. You know, because I, I was sure I was safe. That was that was the safest place I could be. Totally, absolutely. Ah, <sighs> yes, dig straight down over a lava pit. Way to go, man. Way to go. Alright. So yeah, so this puts me in the middle. Um, cool, so. Now, that's the next question. Is it, how many blocks is it? Is it, for, to, for wither skeletons, for them to drop um, and get one hit, is it still like 22? blocks right because this is said so th this block right there is 53 so if they drop straight down they're hitting 20 blocks which still might be a one hit with a good sword so all right i do have sticks i don't know that if it's enough sticks to uh make 20 ladders, but I guess we could find out. Nope, it's enough to make 12. What do I have? I have tools. Um, 
Ender chests. I've got lots and lots of ender chests. Or shulker boxes. I have zero <sighs> ladders. Okay. Well, that's fine. So maybe what I'll do, just to make life easy on myself, I can go widen that platform. And that way, at least, it'll be easier to land on. <laughs> right? Alright, I can do it. I can do it. I can do it. I did it. Are these only... Wow, I thought I had... No wonder I'm going through these. I thought I had grabbed my... Uh... Eight minute fire resist potions, but apparently I don't have those. I just have three minute fire resist potions. I mean, that's okay. I can. It got me out of a mess, but that's still really annoying. Okay, and I. Okay, so that should be wide enough for me to uh, drop in on. Cool. Alright, so now I'm going to have the kill chamber be down here. I'm... Uh, this is going to be... Go ahead and make this a little wider. It's a 22 drop... 22 block drop. Okay. So if I drop them down here, okay, and I'm I'm standing on 32, okay, so that means 52 would be a 20 block, so 54. Basically, they're going to have to stand on top of these, the, the guardrails. It's going to have to be the yeah, spawning area, which, you know, is okay. I can do that. Where, where things are going to get a little hairy. Okay, this is not the time for my... I had... Good news is I have a new HDMI switch. My uh, monitor keeps cutting out because I think it's my existing switch. I have a new one. It's sitting on the dining room table. I haven't installed it yet. Okay, so I should be able to dig out space here and uh, have plenty of room to build a collection system and all that good stuff. So, so the next thing I'm going to need are blocks and the zombie piglin or not the zombie piglin the regular piglin and all that cool stuff so sweet now let's hop up here now ah okay now wait a minute <laughs> that wasn't cool i I feel like I put an arrow through him, and apparently I did put an arrow through him, and it just went all the way through him, and uh, just did not actually kill him, which was annoying. Okay, so, right, so there's my drop. So, I'm going to need material then to do this. I need to get the drop area. Cool, so I'm going to have to head back and pick up some building blocks, preferably ones that are non-flammable. Alright, where's my... Is it this way? Oh no, it's over here. Okay, cool. And I'm gonna need a... to grab a boat and a number of other things. So, cool. Yeah, I said I'd love to 
go through and and pave all the stuff around the around this. Oh, jeez, this spawning sphere goes forever out this way. Okay. Okay. Well, that's a. Uh, I guess that's a thing. <laughs> It really gets out this way. Of course, it's 128 blocks, so... But everything outside the the 24 block... ...will despawn fairly quickly, but... Of course... Yeah, no, well... Shouldn't be too bad. Look, I'll figure it out. It, it said it may not be the most efficient farm in the world, but it will it will totally work. Ah, sunlight. Sunlight is so nice. Yep, I need to figure out what I want to do out here too. This is This looks really cool, but this this area is a little bland. It needs something. All right. Oh, you know what? Well, I guess I can continue to farm sheep. I... All right, I do need to to get a looting sword though. That would be that would be nice. <laughs> All right, so I'm going to throw those in. Throw those in. We'll just hang on to those. Um. All right. Maybe I need a building block. I wonder if I have enough of a block of some sort to uh, build out there with all of the stuff that I would want. <sighs> yeah. I'm, I'm good. I'm good. I do need ladders, though. Okay. And I'll need... Um... Right, so I need a boat. Do I have boats? Oh, if I have boats, they're not going to be in there. I thought I had some boats stashed here, but apparently not. Some unenchanted elytra, but no boats. Cool. So, let's see. Um, doesn't matter what I make it out of. It just needs to be made out of boat stuff. Okay. Cool. So throw the spruce back. Um, actually, I also am going to need uh, trap doors of various sizes. Hey, look, those will work. And let's see, is it? So it's going to be like a nine block drop because it's going to build sort of like the, oh no, I don't have to do that, but I am going to need some fence of some sort. So another brick fence is going to work. Um, I do not need those bones. Cool. Now, what are those? Okay, that should work. And I think in here I've got some, I think I've got some name tags. Yeah. Cool. And just because I keep forgetting to bring the one with me. All right. So yeah, um, I could, I'll could. i just build a sucker out of iron blocks. It'll be great. Um, however, actually, do I have glass? Oh yeah, I got lots of glass. Cool. Um, half tempted to uh, just cover it up and use some tinted glass and do some other things, but no, this is fine. This is totally fine. Now, it's going to have all sorts of issues because I don't have, yeah, because the turtle eggs are going to be, okay. No, it's a... but you pre-ordered one of the Pokemon games. Nice. Nice. Which one did you decide to get? Yeah, 
Yeah, I know. I know there are a couple of uh, couple of streamers I've I watch who are all about uh, Pokemon. I think Pearlescent Moon is going to be streaming the uh, streaming Pokemon tomorrow. Um, Pixel Riffs was all excited to get his uh, his copy of Pokemon too. And then, of course, you know, <laughs> the man Mandolin and her kids are all all about the, the pokes on the mons. All right. Before I go out there and do this, um, all right. Well, it's true. I know you're all about the purple. I forgot the. Is it? Is there a Pokemon Violet? Is that the? one am I remembering correctly I don't know I couldn't re remember the names <laughs> okay so I am going to need lootings over the other place so let's grab some grab some emeralds here yeah scarlet and violet okay so I am gonna need a sharpness book I'm going to need Sweeping edge. Hi. I would like the book, please. Thank you. Um, mending, unbreaking, all that stuff is over there. I think looting is over there. I don't know if I want to put fire aspect on it or not. Um, I guess since I'm doing stuff, I might as well. Yep. Yeah. Well, that's cool. That is cool. I I've played some of the first gen ones. Um, I think I played Yellow for a while. I played that on an emulator, so it was wasn't even on the Game Boy. And I played a little bit. I actually even streamed a little bit of. I forgot which one we had, Sword or Shield. Uh, but okay. I'm breaking three. Uh, mending. Okay. Thank you. And of course, looting. That's the big one. Awesome. I have no levels. Well, this is stupid. <laughs> All right. Let's go to the. Uh, Enderman farm so I can enchant all this stuff. Forgot how I've died in this world recently. There was some... Okay, that skeleton needs to not shoot at me. Okay, end portal. This way. Ah, right. Yeah, so I played that. Played a little bit of... Um, I can't remember. I think it's sword that we have. Uh, but the the grind gets tedious, you know? And you know, it, it that was it's fun. The story was sort of interesting. I just got tired of uh Battling my way through all the Pokemon. Hey, um... Guess who forgot to actually grab a sword to enchant? Got the books. Forgot the sword. <laughs> oh, I'm an idiot. Ah, all right, all right, all right. Fortunately, it's not hard to get up here. Um, what the heck? <laughs> I don't know what that's... I don't know what I just did, but that was, uh... That was all sorts of weird right there. <sighs> all right, all right, all right. Um... Oh, I need to drop off something that I do not need. Um... Oh, I've got... Multiple stacks of rockets here, so just throw one of those stacks in there. Oh, okay, that works too. 
Oh, man. I Chat, I'd blame you, but it's not your fault. I'm just... I was thinking so much about getting the books that I totally forgot that, hey, I needed the sword to put all the enchantments on. Alright, so... Um, I'm breaking sword. Sweeping edge sword should do it. It's only sweeping edge one, but twill serve, as they say. Yep, I just have... <sighs> yep, what I want to do, just while I'm up here, is down over that way, on top of that hill, I want to build something. And I was thinking gonna thinking about doing like a uh, a viewer hall of fame. But I have no idea what I want it to look like, so it's hard to get started. Passwords have gotten too easy to play. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Some of my kids were complaining about that. that the latest uh, Pokemon games were like easy mode. So yeah, it'll be interesting to see what they what they do with that. They make it any easier or not. People have said the same thing about Minecraft though too. Is current uh, current Minecraft is is too easy. They missed the the days when it was like hard. And you know, as someone who doesn't have, you know, a thousand years to play, I kind of like having uh, having some of it be a little easier, just Yeah. So I can understand that trade off. Alright. Oh hey, you know what? Options, sounds, hostile creatures. There we go. There. That that should be a lot easier to deal with. It ends up taking many, many levels here to do all the enchanting, but right. Okay, back to one level. Let's uh Apparently, Guardian Farms are actually even better for XP than uh, Enderman Farms, but they're a little more dangerous because of all of the thorns, you know. Hi, guys. How are you? Okay. So, let's see. Looting three. Okay, really? Really? If only I had a tire chest full of iron. <laughs> oh, yeah. Well, that's true. That is true. Minecraft has got all of the... Being a sandbox game, you've got the choice of how to play. Oh, yeah, I did have anvils here, too. Yes. <laughs> Yes, well, and it's, I mentioned it earlier, right? I'm, I'm one of those people who's totally opposed to, um, like TNT duping and stuff. But then there, are people who's like, yeah, no problem. It's in the game. They haven't patched it out yet, so fair game, right? I, I get that. Not. Okay, it's, it's gonna cost nineteen. Ah, so. So there is that. Pokemon is sort of a, you kind of have to, I don't say you have to play it the same way, but it's 19. wasn't paying attention. No. But you do kind of, you are a little bit more constrained on the gameplay. Again, then again, I play Minecraft with like super cheaty things like free cam and heck, I even oh, I don't have it turned on here. I even turned on gamma 
in the uh, create world for mostly so that I can have better visibility for the stream when I'm and videos and stuff. That is definitely one of those weird things. It's like too expensive. Uh, okay, I might have to. Do I have to? I'll probably have to um, unenchant the sword first. Okay. All right. Well, let's get some more XP here. Hi, guys. It's, uh... but yeah, it's a different world playing Minecraft and stuff for as a content creator versus just playing it yourself. Because, yeah, I, I've got... I use free cam and stuff a lot for uh, content reasons. So I can show what what I'm building, what it looks like, you know. Playing in the end or in the nether uh, can get dark, which is hard for a video, right? Um, I remember it was Good Times with Scar was complaining about that in one of the... I think it was one of the live streams or something. And somebody showed him the gamma. And he was like, Oh, this is going to be so great for being able to film in the nether. Or film in the end, because it's always so dark. And I hadn't really thought about that much, but that's totally the case. So, yeah. Alright. Even though, yes, it is a little cheaty to have your, be able to turn your gamma up in dark places. But, it's a mini HUD I don't, for the most part, I don't really consider cheating. Because most of it's just, it's information either on the F3 screen to begin with. Um, you know, or it's, it's there, you can just kind of look at it, it just makes it easier for it to just to display but okay I think this is probably going to be enough XP so we'll let those guys go alright yeah I had to install a soul sand walkway since this is too short to fly through and I decided to cover the path yep Needed a. I needed a way to get there quickly. Yeah, Kyle. I don't know if you're still around, but if you are, this is my copper farm. Oh, darn it! I've cheesed off some Enderman. Yeah, so I've got a little ENX04 copper farm there. Works surprisingly well for how simple it is. <laughs> Okay, do I have a grindstone here? I don't, but I do know where I have one, so. Let's go take off this, this enchantment and then see if I can do this. Sunday, YouTuber plays some Minecraft freely, admits to using gamma and other effects. Oh yeah, exactly. And it's said some of it is very much... Yeah, I, I am... Getting a little cheaty with it, perhaps, but, but yeah, for the most part, okay. Congratulations, I have made a uh, book I can't enchant. I wonder if one of these guys sells an unenchanted diamond sword. No, they're all going to be... Wow, I mean, this is... Ah, well, congratulations to me. Guess I shouldn't have put fire aspect on it. <sighs> Alright, do I still have all those books? I do. Great. Alright, so, I'm breaking... Uh, not fortune. Looting... Uh, sharpness. 
Those all need to be there. Mending. Wow. Jeez. Somebody doesn't post? Yeah. That I get. Yep. I... There's still something over there. What did I drop? Oh, okay. Dude's got one of my books. Okay, that's... That's cool. That's fine. A ridiculous, useless book over there. Okay. Cool. Okay. I think I've... Alright, hey, give me a... Give me a bookshelf. Alright, um... All right, so mending, sharpness, I'm breaking, looting. Um, I do need sweeping edge, which I've got over at the university. Okay, so sharpness and... Oh, that's mending. Okay, I'm breaking three. All of that. Oops, let's try it the other way. There we go. All right, let's go get some sweeping edge, and hopefully that should should take care of it. It has some right lucky block kind of mods. Okay. Okay, yeah, I could see that. Well, that's one of the things I've... Um, I was really excited when uh, um, I got this GoXLR because... Uh, yeah, this way. Because it allows me to do some audio mixing that I couldn't do with my old mixer. And so I've had a couple of times in uh, in videos where I've had to... Uh, like, I've had to increase the volume of my voice. Apparently, I when I was recording it, I was further from the mic, or I was talking softly or something. And... Okay, now I'm not going to have the levels here 35 36 so I can put a name on it all right back to the Enderman farm but at least I'll be able to enchant the sword jeez monkeys but that was really nice to be able to increase my my voice level or other times turn down the game sounds nope not this one no, no, no. Um, this way. Okay. I'll just fly into those trees. The trees are great. Trees are wonderful. <sighs> so, yeah. All of that, that stuff for content creation is so weird. And I, and I have to admit, I've gotten way too used to uh, my tools. Like, when I set up the Create series, um, there are two versions of, of Create Mod, both maintained by the same people. But the main version is for Forge, and then they've got a Fabric version. Well, the Forge version supports uh, 1.19.2, I think. But the Fabric version only supports 1.18. Uh, dot two. I, th they've, I think they've got alphas out now for 119. But fabric is where all of my mods are, right? All of the, uh, you know, mini HUD and, and tweakaroo and all that stuff. Those are all written for fabric. <laughs> so. I forgot I had mob sounds turned off. Um, it's like, well, I can't live without those. So I guess I'm... Starting on 118 here. We'll uh, upgrade to 119 later. All right, so I need like 40 levels here, so. So this will take a moment. All right. You know, I didn't expect to be doing this much today. <laughs> I'm 
we go. I was kind of thinking, oh yeah, I'll get those trap doors in place. That'll take up most of the time. But other than the fact that I died and lost my sword. Hey guys, do you want to come over here so I can hit you with my sword? Thank you. I appreciate it. You're helpful, Enderman. You are so helpful. Thank you so much for being here and helping me in my sword creation project. Um, like many school projects, um, I'm going to get all the credit and it's only going to cost you your lives. So, good for you. Thank you for helping. Alright, so... Close. I could probably expand the spawning platform up top, but... I might have a couple of spaces out towards the, the the islands that are like right there. They're just inside the spawning sphere. But I thought I got most of that taken care of, but <sighs> So let's see what else is going on. So yeah, oh well, I'm thinking about it. So next week is Thanksgiving here in the United States. And uh, I th so that's going to mean, among other things, uh, there will be no stream next Thursday. So a week from today, uh, there'll be no stream. Because we'll be doing all of the Thanksgiving goodness. You know, eating ourselves senseless, you know decorations and packing and all of the fun stuff that comes with uh, with that. So, almost there. So, yeah. I'll, uh, and I'll po post a reminder about that in uh, the Discord next week as well, but Yep, so and, oh, man, really disappointing. I was, uh, I was looking at my merch store the other day, and my uh, all of the products that were the that's a problem for future me were broken. It was weird. It was just totally bizarre. So I had to take them out of the store. I'll be putting that back in here soon. Um, I was thinking of maybe throwing up another design. Um, maybe using one of the one of the new emotes I've got with the uh, with my Minecraft character on it. So you know if there's one of those that you like, uh, <laughs> hi, cracking voice. Um, you know what, like waving or the uh, thinking pose or whatever that you think would be best on merch. Let me know. I was. My first thought was the the waving emote because that's super easy, um, and it's a little more, I guess, uh, you know, obvious something. All right, Moody Stabby. I actually need to create a new sword over here too for, um, just to have here. So when I do lose my sword again, I can at least come over here and get it. And get XP without having to worry about, oh, I've got to enchant a sword first, or... I've recently been flying without a sword, uh, just using my axe as my main weapon, just for uh, inventory-related reasons, mostly. And that's been... That's been awesome, but it does mean that... Uh, Sometimes I'll come over here to get XP, and I'll totally forget the, about bringing the sword. I should set up another ender chest over here somewhere, too, just to... But... Alright. Cool. Alright, so that's good. And I have way more ender pearls than I am ever going to need. Sweet. And away we go. Oh, man.
But yeah, I've definitely seen a few people doing that. It's like, well, I'm gonna save some inventory space, so I'm just going to ditch the sword and I'm just gonna go axe. Um, I was trying that a little bit on, I think it was on, maybe in the last solo world, actually. Okay, I don't need all of those interpearls. Um, where I was, I stopped using the bow in favor of uh, a trident. Which, you know, worked. Just, uh, unfortunately, the trident does not hit nearly as hard as a fully enchanted bow. Which was uh, a little annoying. Okay, so got an ender chest, got my stuff, all right, got my boat, okay, all right, I think I can make this work now, oh, sweet, I should probably sleep, because it's probably night, and it's all scariness outside, all right, well, this half hour diversion was brought to you today by, you know, why did I think I could fight all of those blazes just right up close and personal, even with a fire resist potion? Oh, no, I need to go down this one. I'm not going on the roof. Um, no, it's over here. I'm lost. Precious is lost. Okay, there we go. Okay, so... I should have brought some gravel with me too, actually, but... That would have made a lot of sense. I'm... I'm still right here. I haven't gone anywhere. I can get gravel quickly. <laughs> no, it'd be good to get gravel to, um clear out the lava under my kill chamber so that I can uh, drop in lots and lots and lots of stuff. Chests and things, right? Gravel. Okay. That should be good. Three stacks of gravel should more than take care of it. Okay. That was dumb. All right, there we go. There we go, there we go. That's true, I could use sand, but I have gravel. <laughs> I have shulker boxes full of gravel. Um, since you, you get gravel from the uh, piglin bartering, and I went, I said, I have a ridiculous bartering farm. Since I'm up here, and I don't want to be up here. Where is it? Um, yeah, gold farm. I'll just, I'll just show it since I'm up here. I went through the wrong portal again. You know, it's, uh, it happens. So, so I've got pretty basic uh, gold farm up here, right? Just, you know, these guys up here doing their thing. Well... Right down through here. I always forget how to break bedrock until I need to do it. And then it's like, all right. <gasps> oh, no. Okay. I screwed up. My, my pigs are all gone. I did have a... I had a problem with my world and I had to recover it. And I lost a number of the entities, and I think all of those entities are dead. Fortunately, they're really easy to get. I just I'm gonna have to reset up the uh, that aspect of the farm. Well, that's good to know. <laughs> Not that I'm going to need it, but it's uh, good to know. All right. Well, next time we need to do a bartering. Um, I haven't needed to for a while, but... Yep, that's another ENX-04 design 
up there. That's the uh, Piglin Bartering Farm farm. It's stupid easy to uh, to actually just build the bartering aspect of that. To set things up, throw a however many jack lanterns in a dispenser for the number of pigs you want, and AFK for a while, and doesn't take long. It doesn't take long at all. About half an hour or so, and you've got all the piglins you could ever need. Okay, cool. So, make our way back here to this place. Now I'm beginning to think I should have been recording for a video. <laughs> I was just going to be doing the busy work, but... Alright. Cool. So now... That... All right, so that's going to be the way down. Um, or that's going to be the killing chamber. I'm going to need a way down. Or I'm just going to fly, I guess. I mean, flying is certainly easy enough to do. All right, so... All right, let's see how I'm going to do this. So... I'm designing this sort of on the on the fly. I know the mechanics of how this is supposed to work, but I have I've not actually built one like this on my own. My own my own little thinking. All right. Okay, I do have the trap doors. Cool. And I'm going to have to build up I'm gonna build a bunch of stuff around around the uh, around the piglin too to be sure just he doesn't get shot by gas or something all right so now all right we'll lose that okay. I have no idea okay I have no idea how deep this lava ocean is. Deep enough. Okay. I should probably give myself a nice drop through, isn't it? Um... Oh, you know what? I think I lost my shovel. I think that's that was the other thing I lost when uh, I have another one, but when I died from the, to the to the uh, blaze. Okay, so now what I want to do. Okay, admittedly, this is a little cheap too. But it's okay. I could just take out the other um, stuff there too. The, those other bricks that do it. But this works too. Alright, cool. So now I should be mostly so do this side too. Okay. That's not where that's supposed to go. There. Oh, hey, I still have some gravel out there. Cool. Alright, so we'll just get all of this uh, lava sort of cleaned out. And I don't know...
Yeah, I don't know if I'm going to need... Uh, need to do anything else with this or not, but... But this should be good for now. Alright. Cool, so that should give me plenty of space to... Uh, Oh, this is my fortune shovel. Cool. All right. Um, I mean, may need to back that up a little bit too, but start there. All right. Um, let's go ahead and dig out a little bit of a. I was gonna say a little bit of a room here, but there really isn't any room. All right. I just needed some space to uh, put down some stuff. So um, let's grab the ender chest. All right, and my redstone chest. Cool. So now, let's see. So they are going to be falling down there. So, careful with that. Also, let's uh, throw a fire resist potion on the hot bar. Because otherwise, I could get a little too hot, you know? Alright, so I'm going to want the endermen are going to drop here. Okay, now not too sure I need to uh, I'm not sure how far I want to actually worry about uh, drops okay so I do need chests there and there Oops. let's actually make that a double chest okay for important reasons. All right. Now, what I should should do, I probably should be placing some sort of wall so my chest doesn't catch fire. All right? That that seems like a that seems wise. Okay, it turns out there's a lot of uh, a lot of lava there. Okay, that's not where that needs to go. Needs to go there. Okay, and this thing come around this side. There. All right, we're good there. We're good there. Cool. Um, so let's I'm just gonna put down another chest here. All right. Cool. So that's gonna go there. Another one of those there. So uh, the. All right, so the idea is now is that the Endermen are going to drop down onto those. Cool. Now, shouldn't matter, but the trap door. All right, so now, let's see. Right, I'll grab my uh, handy dandy box of stuff. It's nice to have a handy box of stuff, you know? Like, I, I could be doing stuff with this, and I totally will. Alright, so now... Okay, cool. Pressure plates. They do things. Alright, so now... So, starting here... And then, K 
Okay. That's where things get kind of fun. There. And there. Okay, so the wither skeletons are going to drop down here. I think I'll stand on these trap doors so that the skeletons will be there. And that means basically I can put glass blocks up here like that. Okay, so I can then stand here, swing away with my sword, right? Just got out here, you know, slashy slashy. And probably just to keep things a little bit there. I can I can close that if I need to. Should not matter in the slightest, but we'll uh go with it. Alright, so now I think what I'll do is I'll just go up this way. Now This is going to go up to is it level 54. All right. Turn that on. Yeah, cuz that's that's what we figured, right? They need to drop 22 blocks. So if they're standing here on standing there on block 54 5 dropping down to here that's 31 so that's uh 22 blocks well 23 actually so so 54 so this should this should be the level i want them on okay i want that guy um See if I can get him in a boat. Hi, how are you? You're gonna have a job. Isn't that great? Aren't you excited? Let's see if I can nudge him into that boat. That's right. You wanna No the boat. You wanna be in the boat. That's right. That's right. Get in the boat. Get in the boat. You're gonna love it in the boat. The boat is your friend. Get it, be, I've seen villagers that would, were more willing to do what they're supposed to. Okay. Okay, get in the boat. Thank you. All right, cool. All right. Oops, let's just hop out of this boat for, for the moment and need to keep you safe, so. If, Okay, he's in the boat, so he won't despawn. Um, but I do need to be sure that... Just put some glass here so that I can see what's in it. And... Alright. And let's get a little bit of iron. Just put them in an iron box. Seems perfectly... Uh, Humane, right? All right, we're just gonna. Yep, just uh, load you up in a box here. Keep you safe. I'll need to name tag him, but I can do that later. Okay. Cool. All right, perfect. That's exactly the guy I need. So. Just need a piglin with a sword. So this is going to be a fun test. All right, so if they're standing, standing at 55, right, so they'll be dropping off 55, so I actually may want to come down a block. And landing here. So yeah, I need to go down one block. Cool, I can do that. Oh, yeah, yeah. 
Very loud kitty downstairs. No, it makes sense. Go take care of the cats. Cats are important. I know my life revolves often around a small fuzzy cat. Actually, it's a large fuzzy cat, but, you know. Oops, I'm up too high. Okay. All right, so I want to be up at this level. Cool. All right, make sure I'm landing in the right place. All right, yeah, this should be all sorts of fun, right? Oh, this is Siamese, yeah. Yeah, they can, they can be loud. Okay. All right, I'm at the right level, yes. So what I need to do is just be sure that, um, turn that off. Um, Make sure that I drop the skeletons in here, which uh, I think this means I'm going to have to put the, well, I'm going to have to put the zombie piglin over this way somewhere. Yeah, see, that's going to be the fun. Is, Making sure I put the piglin in the right place so that the skeletons can't reach him. Okay, so. Come up this way. Now, go ahead and just circle this up so that I don't have anything spawning in it. And it goes all the way around. Yeah. Yeah, no worries. I'm going to be done here in about five minutes anyway, so. Ah, should be. Should be good. I hope. <laughs> Alright, so I am going to have to get some. Um, some of these piglins over here. Now. Yeah, get him over. Of course, bring him over too, I suppose, but. All right, so how do I do this? All right, I need to be sure that the uh, skeletons all come in basically this way and drop down. So I think, given where those are, right, I want to take some trap doors, I think. Kind of like that, and then, yeah, because most of them are gonna be coming from that side. So what I'm gonna want here is some fence. I think I wanna fence this way. I'll set the piglin up over here, I suppose. I think I'll need him up a couple of blocks, which makes that perfect. If I can hit that gas from here. Not with that aim. Oh, got him. Nice. All right, so... So where is this guy going to live? <laughs> That's, that is always a question. Um, so he's going to have to be up high enough and protected and all this stuff. So I think I'm going to have to look into that a little bit more. But, so yeah, skeletons will come around from that side. Well, they'll come from all around here, actually. Um, the other thing I suppose I could do is put a um, turtle shell on his head, too, and just bring in any, um, 
well, I was going to say, bring a, put a turtle shell on his head to bring in any uh, piglins, which I could do. In fact, what I might do should be better, because they'll drop, same thing, they'll take damage, but I don't want to actually... Oh, I can't put powdered snow. Powdered snow would break their fall. Okay. Yeah, so what I'm going to have to do is just set up a little... Uh, set up a couple of... Yeah, a couple of eggs, turtle eggs around to pull off the zombie piglins. Everything else I'm not too worried about, but the piglins... Um, just get annoying if you kill them so <laughs> and i don't i don't need that that stress in my life so all right so basically I think the way this is gonna go since i need this platform here anyway um is skeletons i'm gonna want to come in this way So I want to put the piglin up here. Okay. And yeah. All right. I think I can do this. So I want the piglin up here. I'll need to uh, be sure I've got him in a place where he's protected. And I can pop him out of the boat and all that good stuff. Cool. Um, well, I think that's going to be an adventure for another day because this is uh, going to be, well, I'm coming up on the end of the stream. So, yeah, so that'll be, that'll be all sorts of fun. Um, and I need to bring him down this way, so we'll just do it like that. Cool. Yeah, I'll, I'll just be able to run him down and then drop him off somewhere up here. Right? And I think... Yeah. Yeah, so he'll stand here. I think the Yeah, all of the skeletons will be... Oh, got them. Nice. Nice, nice. So the skeletons will all come. Um, they'll end up having to go around to try to get in at him. So I hope... I hope I've done this right, or will have done this right once I get all of this stuff in. In that... Uh, Oh, oh, hey, I've got mob sounds off. Hostile creatures. Let's hear them when they yell at me. Oh, jeez. Oh, the, the sudden explosion um, scared the bejesus out of me. All the bejesus. Um... And I, I don't know that there were that many to begin with. Whew. Okay. All right. I'm... The good news is I'm still alive. <laughs> but that's one of the things I'm going to have to protect the uh, piglin from. Is, uh, is ghasts and blazes and stuff. But I'm going to be down there. So blazes should not be shooting at this guy. Should just be the skeletons. So cool. Well, we'll try it and see how well it works, but I think that's gonna be a problem for future me. So <laughs> Alright. Well, let's go ahead and pause that and come over here. Whew. Yeah, that was uh that was scary. <laughs> that was really scary. <laughs> but we're good. And and yeah, should be fine. Oh, it's fine.
Anyway, um, I'd like to thank you all for joining me today. It's been a blast, uh, especially there at the end, which it really was a, a blast. Stupid guests. Anyway, thank you all for hanging out. I'll see you on Tuesday. I've got new new video coming out t on Tuesday uh, also, so be sure to like and subscribe for all that good stuff. Smash that bell. You know the drill. And uh, until next time, be excellent to each other. This is Music Free Gaming signing off.